You can get a no display on your monitor for many different reasons. I'm going to show you a bunch of possible solutions and how to rule out a hardware fault where possible. First, let's make sure that the monitor is not the problem. Is your monitor set to the correct input? Look for the source or input button on your display. If you don't have one, the menu button will have it. This monitor has two HDMI inputs, but currently it's set to the wrong one. If I press the menu button and choose input, it switches over and problem solved. I could have also switched the HDMI port the cable is connected to, but this is an easier solution. If for example your monitor has HDMI, you can connect any other device in your house that has HDMI to it to make sure it's okay, such as a games console. If you get display on screen, then you know the monitor is all good. Check what display cable you're using and if it's firmly connected at both ends. You can also try another cable or a different type that your monitor and PC supports. Again, you'll need to make sure the input source is correct. A monitor that has no display from a couple of sources with the correct input chosen could be faulty or have a faulty input. Try another input or a different monitor to see which is the problem. If the monitor is working fine, then PCs showing no display can be for a variety of different reasons. For a PC that has a graphics card, check that the display cable is plugged into the graphics card and not the motherboard, which can be easily recognized by this type of I.O. shield. If you're using integrated graphics with no graphics card, the display cable should go into the motherboard display input. Your PC may not be showing display due to the RAM sticks not making a proper connection. If your mouse and keyboard are not getting any power, this could be the problem. Turn off your PC, remove the power cable and open the case. First try reseating the RAM back in its place. Turn on your PC. If there's no display, unplug the power and try using just one RAM stick and reseating it. You can also try switching the sticks around. Another option is to unplug the power, remove the CMOS button battery on your motherboard and press the power button to drain any leftover power. Wait a minute and then place the battery back into your PC. No display at all could also be a faulty graphics card, but you'd need to rule that out by trying in another PC as well if possible. If you've built your PC, check the power is connected to both the motherboard and the CPU as well as the graphics card if it needs additional power. Reseeding the CPU can help as well. If it is hardware related, it could be the CPU, motherboard, RAM, power supply or graphics card giving you no display. You'll need to rule out as many options as possible to find the issue. That's all for this one, and I hope you get your display back up and running. See ya!